Good, wonderful, beautiful morning, party ends. Where you at, Miss Eleanor? She's like, hey, can you let me out here? No, I thought you wanted breakfast. Did you want breakfast? Hi, Kira. How you doing? You hungry? She's like, wait, there's food? So we woke up this morning, you guys, and of all the couple days we've been here, today is the nicest. The lake is almost flat. The wind is gone. It's supposed to be 55 today, not 35. What do you think? She's like, oh, hey, I'm going to come check you out, Dad. <laughs> but I think we're going to hang out for a little bit. I think Mom and Dad are going to take off before us. And then I think we're going to hit the road and head home today. I think that's the plan. Mm -hmm. She's like, hey, Dad, thanks for taking me camping. This yeah. is pretty fun. I think I like it. Minus the part where I take one dog out at a time and Eleanor has to stay here. Yeah. I could hear her howling all the way down at the end of the road. Yeah, uh, she seems fine when you leave them both here. Yes. And you leave. Yep. But when you, as soon as you take one, she's like, no way. What's e going on? Yep. I want to go. Why didn't you take me? You don't understand why it's one at a time. You'll get it. Mm -hmm. Kira was the same way when she was little. Mm -hmm. Kira didn't like it when I would only take one. So I, I think you'll, you'll get it eventually. Gosh, it's so pretty out there. What? I know this is... <laughs> Are you a complainer? This is new, huh? Hey, look, you got your Jeep. It looks nice. This is kind of amusing watching mom and dad uh, do the trailer instead of us. The mom and dad are getting the trailer ready. They're learning all the things they need to learn. Can you see the bugs flying in the air? They're actually, they're going to empty that one right now. And then uh, we're gonna finish up here and we're gonna get ready to hit the road, I think. We thought about sticking around for a little bit, but I think instead we're just gonna take our time going home and maybe stop a few places. Look at the lake, you guys. Compared to the past couple of days, this is just beautiful. Look, they're going to empty it. I'll be back. Vlog channel. Eleanor, you got yourself tangled on the line. I was like, no, I'm fine. I'm fine. I got this. I'll figure it out. I'll untangle myself. I know it's nice enough today for you guys to just hang out out here with us, minus the bugs. You get her. You get her. Maybe you two shouldn't be allowed next to each other. <laughs> What was worse, the wind or the bugs? Wind. Okay, I think so too. Yeah, at least these aren't biting bugs. <laughs> what are you doing, huh? Yep, keep your mouth shut, don't swallow the bugs. Got it. <laughs> oh my goodness. You're lucky it's not super early. You'd be waking everybody up with all that noise. So in case you can clearly see the bugs flying around, let me show you how bad they are right now. Look at this. There's so many. They're all over. They do love the color white, so they tend to just coat the RV. <laughs> so yeah, we may have had wind the past two days, but uh, at least we didn't have these little annoying bugs, right? So you can always put more clothes on. You can't really get rid of the bugs. And these are the little bugs that like bug spray and all that stuff doesn't really do anything. I think our first trip was a success. I will say that, again, this was kind of like a, not a dry run, but a short trip because we only did two nights. I have a list of things that we need to add to the camper. And that was one of the reasons we wanted to do this. We knew there was gonna be things that we were gonna need and remember to get or add or be like, oh, we need this or we should change this. So I have a list, so for the next time we'll be even more prepared. We did the same thing when we first got our trailer. We kind of tried to do like a short, close trip just to figure out what it is we need that we forgot. I will say. The Blackstone worked out pretty good yesterday making them burgers, but now we got to figure out where we're going to put it. One of the things about this RV versus the trailer, it has some underneath storage, but it doesn't have that big underneath storage like the trailer did, so it's hard to figure out where we're going to put everything. Oh, I see the Jeep. They're like, wait, we know that Jeep. Got all three dogs, last loop around the campground. Hi, Miss Indy. Yeah, Indy, be good. I know, Eleanor's your friend now. You're gonna have to come over and go swimming. Right. What do you think, huh? And the game, is it ice or foam? You missed, Dad. <laughs> it looks like ice, but I i mean, I don't know. Combination of both. Oh yeah, I guess you're right, it could, huh? That's oh, foam. it's foam. We thought it was ice. It was cold enough to be ice, that's for sure. It probably was at one point. That water's gotta be cold, girls. We'll bring you back up here when it's warm, Eleanor, and you can swim in this lake. All the other dogs have done it. What do you think, Eleanor? All three of you. All three of you wanna go in the water and go swimming, huh? Now you're gonna have wet, sandy paws. Yeah. You're gonna have wet, sandy paws. 
Sorry, I didn't bring the long leash. Next time I'll bring it. All right, we are loaded up. You're gonna drive over to the spot. I'm gonna drive your Jeep behind you and then we'll hook up the Jeep. Yep. Dogs are, uh, look like they're ready to go. There's bugs in the camper, huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go get in your Jeep. We're, we're leaving. Bye, Mosca Lounge Lake. That's a pretty good first run, I think. We did good. On the road again. It is really nice out today. Almost should have stayed, minus the bugs that were scaring us away. Not that bugs are bad, you know, we just... You could chew them at that part. Yeah, and we weren't really planning on staying today anyway, so... We're in Trout Lake, which is a really cute little town. And when I say little, like, there's a store and a bar, and that's about it. Oh, the store's for sale, we could buy it! <laughs> yeah, so this is literally all there is in Trout Lake. There's a bar... Grocery store? Yep. And there's a bar, and there's a restaurant bar. <laughs> there's a motel, and a fire station. That's about it. People come here, and you can see the trails over here. They go snowmobiling, and they go wheeling, and that's about it for Trout Lake. So there is one more thing at Trout Lake that I, I always want to go check out, but we kind of can't. It's an abandoned motel. Not the one I was thinking of, but... I just want to go check it out. Can we just... It's not trespassing if we don't get caught. I'm just kidding. <laughs> and we made it to the bridge again. It looks like it's kind of choppy over here, but it doesn't look so bad over there. Yeah, a little bit. At least there's no... Uh, it's a no high wind warning right. today, so... That's a good thing. Very blue. It is very, very blue. You can see mom and dad behind us. <laughs> what do you think? Something I would like to see. What do you think, huh? She's like, this is kind of fancy. Well, what are you doing? She's like, I'm looking over the bridge and checking things out. Oh, and there's Miss Eleanor. She's checking it out as well. They were sound asleep until we had to stop at the bridge to pay the toll. And now they're like, what's going on? Oh my goodness. We did it! Oh. Tired? Yeah. Kira stole my seat. <laughs> She's like, I'm gonna sit up here for a little bit. <gasps> we're home, you wanna go in your yard? Okay, let's do it. Let's get in the yard. I was just like, I don't know what's going on. I was napping. Now I'm awake. Psh, can't go back to napping. <laughs> Are you ready? Are you ready to be in your own backyard? Go! Yes! I was just like, mm, some crazy dogs can run that way. I'm not running all the way back there. <laughs> Some of the grass grew. We were wondering how much of it would grow for being gone for two or three days since the dogs weren't walking on. Yes! Running! Yes, Kira! So happy! Yes! They're like, you know what? We like camping, but we also like coming home to our yard and running in circles. Well, minus Memphis. Memphis is like, hey, look, this is my bed over here. You seriously got into your bed. <laughs> She's like, hey, this is mine. I love it. I would just take a nap here. You've been napping all day. Yeah, but I could nap here as well. We did it. We're home. We're in our own house again. What did you think? They're like, I don't know. That was pretty amazing. I think I liked it very much. Work never ends. So Jamie just cut the grass. He put his mower blade on really, really high because we're trying not to damage the new grass that's growing. But now that it's cut, you can really see how much of it has actually grown back in. I mean, over there was already there and over, over here was already here, but it's looking like grass again. All right, Kira, I, I heard it. And then I saw what you were looking at. She's like, guys, there's something on the ground out here. We better go check on him. Oh, he's thinking about getting up. Oh, he's standing up. I just wanted to get him off the cold ground. I don't know what kind of bird he is, but he's really pretty. Maybe get the box closer. I'm glad he picked his little head up though. Hey buddy. The cement was just so cold. Mm -hmm. I just didn't want him sitting on the cold cement in shock, you know? But hey, he picked his head up and moved around. Yeah, we'll give him a little water and we'll let him chill out here. I just wanted, like I said, I just wanted him off the ground because it was so cold. So according to Google, he's a red-eyed vireo. And he does have red eyes. Jamie just looked. Mm -hmm. I think he'll be okay. It's like, I just gotta stretch my wings and stuff, guys. He's a really pretty bird. So we made him a little more comfortable and kind of covered him a little bit because it's a little windy out here. He moved around when Jamie was petting him. He's still... He's just in shock. It happens when they hit the window. Look, the little box is empty. It started to sprinkle just a bit and uh, the little bird flew off. So apparently 
he's okay. Well, good morning, sunshine, even though it's the good night clip. Oh my goodness. So we're all exhausted from camping. The other dogs are already outside. We forgot to have a little good night clip last night. So Memphis and I are going to go ahead and do that right now. What do you think, Miss Memphis? She's like, yeah, right now it's good. <laughs> uh, all right, you guys, we hope you enjoyed today's video. As always, thanks so much for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Stay positive, dream big, and we will see you again soon. Good night, audience.